me and, me and Reggie were tight, okay? Me and Reggie were pretty tight, we're pretty good buddies. Every once in a while, you know, we'll head out back and have a couple uh, of waters. I'm sorry, but why is there a hot dog in your PC? Did this day get any worse for me? I get arrested in the middle of the night. I don't get my promotion, because apparently I can't dress very well. Yes, I'm experiencing, and now I get my head comfy. Oh my goodness! Oh, you know I'm gonna just say it. This company is going under. It doesn't matter if they get the park. We'd get the park right back. Yo, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another sneaky Sasquatch video. In today's video, what we're planning on doing, or hopefully doing, is I want to try to get some some of the new caches that have been released, the new red boxes and. You don't know what cash means, or the cash is what, whatever. It's a confusing name. I wish they'd just leave it as treasure boxes. Anyways, if we have a look at our time or watch, it's currently 12:40 a.m. So what we need to do is, because the first one is in the woods, which is that's not very obvious, is it? It's not very descriptive. It's just in the woods. First of all, we need to drink a can of a uh, Red Bull. So let's just drink this up real quick. In fact, we're gonna drink two cans of Red Bull because we're failing ambitious. But yes, um, the first one, as you can see, what time is it? It is 1:01 a.m. I don't want to be late for this. Okay, I don't because I've been late before. Pardon me. What are you doing? What are y'all doing up at one in the morning? Anyway, so the first one is if we pull in over here, it's back this little lane over this way. We need to run back this way and follow this little trail around. say it's aha here it is all right so if we look at this it's locked but if you look on the thing it says four o'clock and it also shows darkness I don't know really what that means but I'm guessing it means that it has to be pitch black and dark in order for us to use this so I'm gonna sit over here on this bench and I'm gonna um, you know just casually drink another Red Bull um, just to help keep us awake because no, gotta you gotta stay uh gotta stay awake. All right, eight minutes. This better be what it is. Oh, it's right there. Oh, we got it. Oh, that's a fat boy. How much is that thing worth? I'm guessing a thousand. Oh my goodness. We just made some bank. So it's only open at four in the morning. Okay. Now I gotta get out of this place. So this is gonna be a little bit of a mess. But I've noticed also I'm not getting tired at all. So I don't know if that's from the Red Bull. All right, well, let's. Uh, what did I just go? Oh, I'm. Oh crap. Oh crap. I'm going to jail, guys. Well, this means we're gonna wake up at like. Crud. This is a problem, actually. This is like a serious problem because now it's like the middle of the day morning yes but it's like 12 in the afternoon you're free to go stay out of trouble hey look man I didn't mean to see now it's 1201 what am I <sighs> well now we got to go to work that was kind of unfortunate stupid can we get a like that stupid dude just backed out or backed up in front of me walked right behind me it's retarded well now I gotta get dressed up all right, let's get dressed up in my uh, work clothes. Sorry I was late. I just had an uneventful night. I spent the night in prison. It kind of sucks. Anyways, let's run over and let's do some more tech, uh, computer technician work. There we go. Since we're a computer technician, um, we're going to do this. And then hopefully we'll get a promotion. Hey, dude, Barbara Jr. here. Come to my desk pronto. Big tough one problems, real tough ones. You know, Barbara Jr., you need to get a life. You couldn't fix... You couldn't take a pizza slice and grab a tea. Hey, man, Reggie, I can do that. You know what? Me and you are pretty close. We're tight. Me and, me and Reggie, we're tight, okay? Me and Reggie, we're pretty tight. We're pretty good buddies. Every once in a while, you know, we'll head out back and have a couple uh, of waters, you know? Um, where is Barbara Jr.? He is not here. Where is 
Bobber Jr. Oh, they want something? Hi, Tommy. Can you go over to the diner and pick me up a soda? No problem, Barb. I guess he's on floor four. Let's hope he's on floor four, because I don't feel like going to any other floors. I like coffee. All right, Barbara Jr., there you are. Uh, what do you got? A hot... I'm sorry, but why is there a hot dog in your PC? I did too, fix it. Look at it. Idiot. You can keep it. I think I'm done with it. You better be done. Hey, we filled the bar. That means we're good to go. Uh... Excuse me, I need to see what's inside this fridge real quick. Y'all don't need any of this stuff, right? Anyways, right? Alright, that's cool. Whatever. Yo, we can actually eat here? Well, I'm not hungry anyways. Actually, I am hungry. I shall now sit down and eat. I don't know what... Oh, yeah, you know what? I can eat my hot dog. Oh, I have a can of grape soda. Grape soda is actually pretty good. I will be honest with you. It's, uh, it's some pretty decent stuff. Alright, let's run down to floor two. And actually, we need to run to floor one because we need to see about getting a promotion since we filled our bar all the way up. Good morning. I mean, afternoon. I've been hearing great things about you. How would you like a promotion? I would love a promotion. Great. Let's say we will have available. Ah, the perfect job for you, executive. But we can't see, we can't have our executives walking around dressed like you are. Well, thanks. This position is only open to serious candidates who know how to dress like an executive. <sighs> Alright, we gotta make a quick run for Reggie and Barb. And on that way, we're gonna stop at the clothing store. Because we gotta apparently get some executive clothes. Hum de hum de hum. Hello, Reggie. How are you doing? Give me my 80 bucks and I'll get out of your hair. Alright, let me see. Is there anybody else that needs some crap done? Barber Jr. Again! Barber! Fix your own computer. I don't have time to keep running to your desk. Fixing your computer again and again. Good night. Well, at least, see, Barb. Look at Barb. She's over here working. The entire time I was going, she's still working. That's what I like to see in a person. Look at the computers. Like, at the heading at the top. Turn it on. What the world? Why are there like four other things plugged in? Look at what it says. 1992 Raccoon Enterprises. Why? 1992? It's 2020. That's 28 years old. Get a na new computer. Good grief. Over here trying to run a park out of business. And at the same time, they don't feel like upgrading their computers. You know, I think this... <sighs> Could this day get any worse for me? I get arrested in the middle of the night. I don't get my promotion because apparently I can't dress very well. Yes, I'm experienced. And now I get my head comfy. Oh my goodness. Oh. Yes, I'm experiencing. Thank you. Oh my goodness. The elevator should be operating normal now. Blah, blah, blah. Some animals were chewing on the wire. They don't even know how to fix an elevator. This company is screwed up. You know, I'm going to just say it. This company is going under. It doesn't matter if they get the park. We get the park right back. So, they think I can't dress very well. I'll show them bozos. I just want to sip it till the pain wears off. By the executive. Thank you. Hey, you know what? Shut up. All right. Let's get out of here. If I would run into somebody, that would make my day even worse. All right, now will you hire me? I just ran into your sign, and I don't even care. I've been carrying great things. Yes, I would love a promotion. You'll be working from your from your office on floor 4F. You'll need to attend meetings, sign paperwork, and occasionally golf with Mr. Pemberton. Hehehe. <laughs> it's a real cushy job. You can start right away. Also, feel free to do your old jobs as well. But I'm an executive. I don't do mail runs. Let's go to bed. That's the first thing. I'm going to just go immediately to bed. Alright, go to bed. Thank you. Now, what we have to do is wake up. It's 8.01. No time for eating. We have to go. You know where we got to go? We have to go somewhere. What time is it, actually? It's 8.07. I think we can make it. Alright, run over here. We're going to get the final cash. This is not how you get the final cash, Matt. It's over here. 
Damn. Run down this way. Don't get stuck on the tree because that's not what you want to do. Run all the way over here. And run down this way as fast as you possibly can. Going. Boom! It's opened! Let's go! How much are those worth? 250. Alright, made some more money. That's what I'm talking about. 18 out of 18. That is what I like to see. Alright, now listen. We have a very important day today. We are going to go golfing with Mr. Pemberton. What do we have in store for today? Meeting at 9 o'clock. Missed that. Signed paperwork. 3 and 4 is golf. Alright, well we gotta go to the meeting. It might still be going, I don't know. Can we go to the meeting on floor 5? Or is everyone gone? <clears throat> meeting? It's wrapped up. Whoops. Uh, well, let's go back to my office. What else do we have to do? 12 o'clock. We need to sign paperwork on floor 4. It is currently 10.30. Can I shut this off? Turn it back on. Alright. 10.37. Um, let me go actually up to floor five, uh, 6. Actually, no. We're going to go to floor 2. We're going to do some technician work. We're going to go do some computer work for some other idiots around the office that don't know how to run their computer. I'm not... I'm not... Alexa, shut up. I'm not talking to you. The world. Alright. I'm not going to be making deliveries here. Okay, because I ain't got time for that. Alright, old Marv, I'm coming. Uh, floor four, I believe. He's at the same place we work, right? I think? No. Yes. I think. He's down here. Yes, he is. Hello, old Marv. 1992 Raccoon Enterprises. Workstation ready. See you, idiot. It's that, it's that easy. Alright. It is quarter after 11. I think we can maybe get one more in. What are you doing? You're walking away from your thing? No. You can't come to your fridge. I'm taking everything. As... As executive, you're not allowed to work here. We are now going to burn something down. What can we actually burn? Let's do this. Let's put an orange in there. For like 30 seconds. Start. Start. Oh yeah. Can I do something else? That's hilarious. What happens if we put this thing in for like, I don't know, just shut it and put it in for like 9 minutes? Start. Alright, what time is it? It's 11.30. See, I told you, old Marv, I took everything out of the fridge. Can't get nothing now. Hey, what are you doing in my office? Oh, are oh, you bringing me paperwork? Good for you, because I got to sign paperwork at 4 o'clock. Or 12 o'clock. It's currently 11.46. Where do I have to sign paperwork, though? Do I just sign it here? Um, 12.05? Oh. Oh, hi there, Tommy. I was wondering if you could sign off on this for me. Mocha for Bob at vacation day for Old Richard budget for Old Guggins Jr.'s birthday. Approved. Approved. Um. Approval request. Yeah, it's approved. Signature. Thank you. Whew. I didn't think that would get approved. What happens if I reject? <gasps> 120 coins! Oh, we make it bank, boys. I need to go eat lunch. Because if not, I'm going to get cranky. And you don't want a cranky executive, do you? I think I might go do some more computer work. And then we are going to go golfing with Mr. Pemberton, our enemy. And we are going to shut him down. Completely destroy him in golf. This is Barbara. Barbara. Go Barbara. You know, I, I like Barbara. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be honest with you. I kind of like Barbara. She's nice. All right, Barbara. What's your computer technician problem? It looks fine to me. There's a piece of pizza in there. Why do you have a piece of pizza in there? It is too fixed. See? Shut up. Why? Why do they always stand there around me waiting? 
and then when it gets fixed, they just walk off. So, we need to go golfing at 3 o'clock on floor 6. I'm going to run to floor 6 right now and see what they want me to do. Like, what I mean by that is I want to see if I have any appointments available. So, it is 149. Hi, Tommy. How are you? Your appointment isn't until 3. Please come back then. They are dead set on time. You know, I think I'll just stay here and wait. I don't think I need to go anywhere. I'll just I'll just wait here. One minute. How are you? Are you ready for your golf to go golfing with Mr. Pemberton? Yes, I am. Is waiting outside for taking a freaking limousine? Guys, we are golfing with Mr. Pemberton right now. We gotta we gotta show him up. Alright. Oh yes, right there. Come on, baby. Go in the hole. What a what a golf swing. What a lucky shot. Oh, well, let's see yours then. Oh, Drat, The wind must have caught it. Oh, bull. You didn't nothing to catch that. I'm faster than you are. You're so fat and slow. All right. Hopefully he doesn't. Good. Try and beat that shot. Ha ha. I'll beat that shot. It's gonna take you four to get it in. Another smashing shot for me. And I made it in with two. Shut up. I got a birdie, a fine shot, but I could have done better. Oh, bunch of baloney. This dude is smack talking. Zuh. Two to four. I completely destroyed him. What is he talking about? Hole eight? Oh, this one. Alright, let's line it up here. Thinking about right there. Come on, get in the hole. Oh, it's just off. Shoot. Oh well. Uh, almost a great shot. All right. Well, what do you got? What can you do? You didn't even make it on the green. This dude is such a trash talker. Good grief. It's almost in the hole, but it's not. Okay. I've got this game in the bag. This dude is a nut. I can't even see the hole for one. That's debatable, but like, I've gotten two birdies. It's four to seven. You need to ease up on your grip a little bit. Yeah, my grip on the game. Oh, yes. I'm gonna just play it easy. And just go like right there. Because every single time I try to go for a hole in one on this, it always fails miserably. I always bounce off the trees. I forgot because I'm supposed to slam it really, really far. Because if you hit it really, really hard, you can bounce it off the trees in the back. Like, over across the path. But I forgot about that. It's alright, though. We'll just make it in right here. Look at this putt right here. Oh, beautiful putt. Look at that. Birdie. Fine shot, but I could have done better. I completely destroyed you in this game. What is this dude talking about? 6 to 11. You're having a lucky day, I see. Yeah, baloney. Just beat you up like it was nobody's business. Shut up. You got lucky. No, I didn't. Can I go in as a place, please? Oh, I can't. How are you? I hope you had a... You two had a good time. He thinks very highly. I wish he could take me golfing once or twice one time oh it's 509 well it looks like we gotta go home well I want to thank you all so much for watching this episode hopefully you enjoyed um yeah I just like said it earlier I just want to thank you all so much for the for helping me get to 100 subs and uh, yeah I would just want to thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you all in the next one peace out